a starting line for you. Action. <laughs> hey everybody. Um, so I am cooking my dinner tonight with Leeks. Um, and I was just thinking to myself, I bet a lot of people have no clue what to do with these things. So like, how many times are you at the grocery store and you see these and you're like, hmm, I want to be fancy and cook with Leeks, but I have no effing clue what to do with them. Well, I am about to tell you. So the first thing that you want to do is make sure that you wash them really well and then um, peel them down. I read um, one time a long time ago that leeks grow in the sand, so they have a lot of like, you know, sand and dirt in them. I might be totally wrong, but who knows. Um, but anyway, so what you're going to do is use the bottom of them and you just chop the root off and then you just slice cameraman are you getting this and then you're just gonna slice them like this see and if you need to peel the outer layer off just like an onion then go ahead and do that but you're gonna cook with them just like you would an onion um, in the same types of places and this is this is how I do it but or how I use them just in place of an onion so tonight I'm sauteing them with mushrooms um, and cauliflower rice and um, salt, pepper, garlic, and then whatever other seasonings and herbs I feel like doing. Um, and I know what you're asking. Why use a leek instead of an onion? And the answer is this. The more you switch out different um, varieties of fruits, fruits and vegetables, the more you are ensuring that you get all the full spectrum of phytonutrients and, and um, minerals and vitamins and stuff that you need. Um, so you always want to kind of change it up a little bit. So next time you go to the grocery store, befriend the leeks, wash them, slice them just like you would an onion, and then just saute them like, like anything else. So that is all. Goodbye.